Our tour of local basketball teams continues tonight in Red Lake. The boys hoops team reached the Class A state tournament last season and would like to make a habit of it. Let's take a look at the Warriors. The Red Lake basketball team won 23 games last season on their way to a Section 8A title. The Warriors would love to hit the repeat button. We won a repeat last year, so we tell them just to keep going, and if we want to go back, we have to keep going, keep trying. The Warriors need to soldier on without 2,500 point scorer Ryan Holtheson, who graduated last year. The players look forward to the chance to pick up the scoring slack. We ain't dependent on one guy anymore. We got a whole five, just move the ball. I have a lot of players that can score on every, any given night, which is a good a plus this year, and the chemistry is really well. We don't really focus much on offense. We, we know, know that defense creates offense. Red Lake surrendered 70.6 points per game last season, which is too many for a team with high aspirations. Our coach has us working twice as hard on defense than he has on offense. The boys received the defensive message loud and clear. Defensive communication is really good. Um, they're not afraid to speak up when somebody needs help. We just have to stay determined every day, stay on track. Perhaps the track will lead to another long playoff run. As long as we stay together, we get the schoolwork done, we get the, you know, get to the floor. Once we get on the floor and play our defense, get out and transition, we'll, we'll be pretty good. The Warriors begin their season on Tuesday with a trip to Black Duck. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.